All right, you guys. So, how many times, or how many of you, because I know I have, gone to the mailbox and you find an AARP with a card on there, <laughs> you know? And I'm like, what? I haven't even reached the age yet. I'm still 21. <laughs> right? <laughs> I will never tell my age. So, Anyway, I would like to introduce Linda and so Solis. Yes. So thank you so Hi, much thank for you coming for on us. my show. <laughs> so Linda, you guys sh share with us a little bit about what it is you do. Well, everyone knows about AARP, <laughs> but we are the AARP Foundation, the, the nonprofit umbrella of AARP, and we have a senior employment program, and we serve Tulare, Kings, Fresno, and Merced counties. We help those that are age 55 and over that are unemployed seeking to re-enter the workforce and we pair them up with community agencies for-profits, wow. non-profits, colleges, community agencies, um, anywhere and everywhere. Oh, that's wonderful because I know, you know a lot of people you know recently and you know, stuff have lost their jobs and stuff like that mm -hmm. and they're like my goodness where am I gonna start now what do I do where do I go who do mm -hmm. I talk to so that's nice to know that you know they can get a hold of you right we have offices in Visalia behind Pet Boys on Mooney and Sunnyside at the Fresno Manchester Center upstairs and at the Merced office in Merced okay. uh, we serve like I said Tulare, Fresno Kings and Merced counties we're looking for employers and agencies who would like to host our workers. We oh. have about 160 program participants, okay. and we're looking for places to host them, train them, and consider them for a job should one become available. Wow, that's wonderful. Free help. Free, Free mature help. workers. Yes. They're dependable. They're, they're going to show up on time. They're not going to call in hungover for the majority. <laughs> uh, you never know. We got a few of those. But um, <laughs> well, you just hit the key word there. Yeah. Dependable. Mm -hmm. You know. Mature. And how about disciplined? Right. Yeah. <laughs> you have to be disciplined. Yeah. Know, they're old so. school, good workers. And some of them, because of a divorce, a death, um, they're, you know, they have come into a situation where they now are have to re-enter the workforce, and and no one's willing to give them a chance. Yeah, because uh, what like their age, or you're too old to do this, right. or you're overqualified. Right. I'm, overqualified I, is, is key. Yes, yeah. overqualified, and you're like, what, really? You know, is but it, yeah, you hear that a lot. The good thing is, we send them to the community for free. We pay them. We cover their workers' comp, <gasps> so it's at no cost to any employer or agency. Oh, we're just wow. asking people to give our folks an opportunity to train and right. be considered for a job. That's wonderful. That's nice to know, Linda. You know to be able to do that. And how long have you guys been doing this? For or? 49 or 50 years. Was it 50? 49. 49 years. 49 yes. years. Wow. And you guys are everywhere. So, you know, if you're needing that help, you know, to find a job and or help out, volunteer, whatever, you know, just call Linda and let her know what it is that you're interested in and you know, and where can you report to and, and go to. So that's wonderful, Linda. It's Yes. I love that. Mm -hmm. So, um, and okay, so AARP has been around. You guys have been doing this for 49 years. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been doing this? 15 years. 15 years. I was 21 when I started, like you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm 21. <laughs> and, uh, oh, that's wonderful. That's nice to know that, you know, hey, you've been there. You know how it works. Mm -hmm. They're not just going to somebody that don't know what they're talking about. Right, you know? right. So that is wonderful. Is there anything else out there that you would like to share with our viewers? about AARP? Really just give us an opportunity to send some of our people to be considered. It's free, they're, they're free workers. We're funded by Department of Labor. Okay. Department of Labor asks that we get at least 100 people real jobs, not just on our program, but graduating from our program into a real unsubsidized job. So we are funded by Department of Labor. Uh, typically they work from 18 to 25 hours a week, earn minimum wage, $9 an hour. Wow. We have money to provide them training, CNA, security guard, forklift. We partner with a lot of the nonprofits, Proteus, CSET, various training colleges. So we're, we're a good source for anybody 55 and over who's looking for work or considering leaving their employment and, you know, looking for something else. Right, right. So, um... Well, say like, okay, well, like my husband, even retired people can come in yes. and do it, right? So say, okay, like my husband's medically retired and stuff, and maybe he wanted to do something like this. 
so he can, even though he has, you know, disability, disability income or retirement yes. income, we, since we're funded by Department of Labor, they do have to meet income eligibility. Okay. But we exclude disability. So if he's getting $5,000 disability check, he can still work because that's considered zero income. Wow. That, see, that's good to know. I'm glad I asked that yeah, question because I'm sure a lot of people don't know about that. We don't count unemployment insurance. Okay. Uh, we don't count um, federal, I mean federal, veteran pension. Okay. So there's a, fle a few exclusions. So it's best just to call our office and we'll refer you to the correct location and see if you qualify and start the process. Wonderful. Oh, wow. So you guys get a hold of Linda, you know, and, and see what's out there, what's available for mm -hmm. you and say, you know, this is, you know, what's going on in my life right now and I really need to do something. And gosh, because times are hard right now, you know. And well, I met someone in your lobby who wants, says his dad is looking for work. He's retired. See? And, <laughs> and see? he's bored at home. So, you know, people get bored. They, they lose their interest in, you know, I guess... They need to be active. They need to be involved. You have to be active. Earn your own little side paycheck. Right, right. You have Meet to do people, that. Meet people, network. Yes, networking. Yes. Mm -hmm. Talk about way. networking. My Visalia participants, over the last 15 years, I've had four marriages from the program participants. We meet once a month, and you kind of get to know the other participants, and I've had four marriages. Oh, <laughs> is your dad married? Are you, oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> hey. And he's a good Oh, and he's go. a good well, I got a good cook. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's one to see. Who knows? That's wonderful to know, Linda. That that's neat. And yes, you have to work. You got to keep yourself busy mm -hmm. because when you do not keep yourself busy, that's when you start going down, and you right. don't want to do that. In fact, they were saying last night on the news about uh, people that sit all day, and not do anything, that it cuts your lifespan in half. You know that they're saying that now. Whatever you're doing, you know, if you're if you have a sit down job, get up and stand up for three, four minutes, or walk around your cubicle right. or something, you know. And so, yeah, you want to get active. You want to be out there and start talking to people because that just. Well, the oldest person on my program is George Jorge Gamboa. He's from Merced. He's 90 years old, and the youngest one, of course, is 55 because that's the right. minimum age. So, and wow, he's he's 90. involved because he's not. He hasn't earned enough credits to get his own Social Security mm -hmm. because he came to this country later in life. So it's been helping him a lot. Wow. So, Linda, how can they get a hold of you, sweetie? Well, we have a 1-800 number, and then we have our local Visalia number. So which okay. do you prefer? Whichever one. <laughs> well, how about 625-8088? Awesome. So get a hold of Linda and see what's there for you guys. Or if you know someone that needs to, you know, to get out and, and do something, Get a hold of Linda. We'll see you guys right back. Thank you. Thank you.